the crowd. Yeah. And Mayweather just behind him, is he just, just whispering things to him, just talking to him. And he'll be just focused on what Mayweather's saying to him. The future of boxing. Well, tonight is going to show us just a little bit more about whether or not that is actually the case. Tate Davis got himself into terrific shape. He struggled to make the weight, but he got there. It's to tell him, you're the champion. This is your moment. Will Liam Walsh be the man to explode that? Same way, same way. You ready? Let's go, baby. Well, is he ready? Is it going to be? Oh, 21 wins! And no losses. 14 of those wins coming by way of knockout. He weighed in at no Messi, the reigning, defending, undefeated IBF super featherweight champion of the world. The tank, Javante Davis. So let's just have a good, clean fight, OK? Most of all, remember to defend yourselves at all times, all right? Touch glove. Keep we'll see. Will that be a problem? So many theories, so many thoughts. Now the Second world host, title fight world is underway. <laughs> Tremendous atmosphere here at the... ...born that will start up is... Uh, ...target to be standing. It's a dangerous shot and his lead up is special powerful. The jab Javante Davis took. That's the power shot. Foot to foot, living every punch with his jab. Davis is going to land that shot over the top. It's not a bad shot. A start from um, Walsh. There's got to be more positive. Nicely punching up with that jab. Well, he's a smaller man, but he's a longer reach. As Davis may be. Mayweather show shouting to Davis. Take your time. Take your. Referee had spoken. Quite opening round. Cagey one, isn't it? Bit of a scouting mission for both boxers here. High guard. Again, Davis falls short with Walsh, which does find the target, and the body shot, and the bell sounds to end an interesting, though quiet, opening round. Davis suggesting that Liam Walsh was scared when he sat down to lead off that's why nothing's happened to throw a shot but Davis very clever and they're trying to get the opponent to lead off and so far the Grazzo was right into to his hands did the copper box crowd pulling short with that left hand Walsh won't commit really and that's a little bit better but he's got to hit the target there John just missed with that right hand and pushing Walsh back good left hand from Davis. Walsh is the sign of there of that foot when he brings his left leg through, he came square. But occasionally he comes. To shout his instructions. There's the left hand counter from Davis. He has got fast hand. Third with Floyd Mayweather at the end of this round. At the tight one, but maybe the cleaner shots coming from Davis. To this point. Well, I'm not Floyd Mayweather Jr., I'm Floyd Joy Mayweather. My father is Floyd Mayweather. But um, I'm liking it so far. Almost father figure was doing at ringside, and now we carry on into the third. Davis, take that last one for you, Richie. I think so. We'll give another close round, but Davis from clever, and then springs out, doesn't he, with that, that hand that it could turn into a little bit of a stalemate for a while. We're going to explode. Davis lands with a left hand to, to Walsh, and another one aimed at the body, goading Walsh. And what he's also doing. John is to the contest. What we need to go through the gears a little bit, put his opponent on Bravely under a little bit more pressure, comfortable because of the pace that Pedraza was setting. That's what needs to happen. Well, Walsh has certainly not been off in any sort of way. All the power shots, all the bigger shots are coming from Davis. At this point, that's a big left hand, and Walsh wants it on. He now landed on the side of the head, and another one. 
He's desperately trying to force, but Davis knows he's hurting, and he's going looking for him now, and he's trying to finish it here, and he puts him to power of Davis, and Walsh just couldn't live with it. Yeah, a couple of big shots there, went in from Davis, left hand especially, but Liam Walsh has got to get his hands up, John, his hands are still too low, he's got to get them up. He's on unsteady legs, he looks as though he's gone here, Walsh. One more and it's all over, he stopped it. He's unleashed the power shots. There was only going to be one winner. And Jibos of this young man has been just too much. And he was blown away with those powerful... With a couple of really good shots. Let's have a look here. He's in trouble at this stage. There's that one left hand there. Now Walsh is trying to grab him here. He's just trying to get away from him in terms of the punch he would. Now look how low his hands are, John. Then he gets caught with that big left one there. And again. And then he goes to the, to the ground. And that's mainly because Walsh did a couple of big shots there that could have been avoided. The referee decided, made the decision. And the take another look. Well, that landed somewhere around the ear. And you can see the concern of Michael Alexander straight away is in there. Straight away is in there and says that is enough. The way and the street fighter in Davis came off. He wouldn't be stifled. He was pushing him away. He knew what to do, John, didn't he? Michael saying, let's have a return, let's go to Vegas. Well, inexperienced champion, he certainly knows how to finish an opponent off. At 17 knockouts now in the 18th contest that he's had. I'm afraid to say he's going to feel as though he didn't really get into the fight. Words of congratulations for Frank Warren, who really fancied Liam Walsh's chances tonight. Declaring the winner. And still, the IBF junior lightweight champion of the world, the tank. Javante Davis! Ten, twelve seconds, and he's still stumbling. Against a banger like Davis, it's got to be stopped then. So I don't think it was late, if, uh, late, if, sorry, early, if anything. It could have been stopped ten seconds earlier for me. Barry Jones? Yeah, I, I wouldn't have had you with the stoppage. Thoughts on the performance you have just produced here in London? Um, first of all, I want to thank, I want to thank God. Um, Today the performance was great. Um, I ended my camp in Las Vegas with Floyd Mayweather Jr. He was he was a lot. In, he, he made the lot in camp, you know, because um, he he just stuck with me. He trained with me.